Okay, win number 25 done and over with. That's 25. It's a uh, it's a quarter of the way to 100, which is pretty cool. You don't always see that every day. There's a seed for you, curious kitties out there. Okay, old capacitor. I'm good with. And let's go. We start with the razor. Um, and nightlight. And let's see. What are we looking for for stats here? Our speed is good. Our tier rate is low, but our damage is very high. And our shot speed is good, and our range seems to be okay. So I would say, uh, you know what? It's so far, I'm liking it. Of course, my philosophy is you can never have too much tier, tier rate. So, okay, those guys can hop, I think, I believe, one rock. Oh, yeah, we also have three red hearts to start, which is phenomenal. Probably the best starting HP you can get, actually, one might even say. So Nightlight is <clears throat> kind of messy. Um, you can keep things slowed if they're in your cone. But, like, it, if you, you don't really want Nightlight if you're fighting the Beast. Not saying we're gonna fight Beast. But when you do, it's just difficult because it makes some of these shots asynchronous with each other. So dodging becomes difficult. Okay, so ra the raise. Ooh, Humbling Bundle is really good. We're gonna try and get that. The Razor is probably not going to be that important, um, if I had to guess. I just can't imagine it's going to be worth <clears throat> too much. Also, let's m mention we picked up Little Brim from the shop. Or no, 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 no. From the item room. And that's awesome. Little Brim is great on the first floor. We love seeing it here, that's for sure. Um, let's go ahead and also... I think the secret room is right here and we're gonna try and get it for free yeah okay couldn't get it could not get it so old capacitor we don't really want because it kind of mess it prevents an active item from charging I mean, that's just like terrible <laughs> it's like not what you want so let's see <clears throat> throat is still giving me problems Sug. so I know it's a long shot, but we're going to try and get... Ooh, okay. <clears throat> okay, we got our bomb back, at least. So, relatively harmless to try the golden chest beforehand. And uh, Bobby Bombs is great. Five, ooh, five extra bombs and key, okay. So, Bobby Bombs is sweet. We get five extra bombs. The homing part of it is probably not going to be too valuable to me. Um, I don't really use bombs in that way often, like offensively. Like if, especially if you like the run's good, you're not really just going to be thinking about, oh, I need to drop a bomb right here right now. So Humbling Bundle, great. Totally worth blowing up a donation machine. Absolutely agree, especially on the first floor. And now let's go ahead and find our secret room. Sorry, I have to keep muting because I have to keep clearing my throat. I don't know what's going on with me, but... Same problem as uh, the last video. Just, I just, I'm, I must be talking myself out of a voice here. <laughs> Second secret room, let's give it a shot. Alright, I'm liking it. And uh, five battery pieces. Cool, cool, cool. Boss is Dingle. And the black variant, I believe, means... So there you go, there's... Yeah, one super fast charge. And then he's tired again. You know, it's, it's hard to move that fast. You know what I mean? You gotta take a break. I understand him. What would we like to see from the boss? I mean, I'm probably gonna be happy with anything, you know. Uh, except that. I don't think I'm too happy with that, but... It's okay. It actually turned out pretty well thanks to Humbling Bundle. It's more than seven cents. Okay, we got an arcade. Oh, we gotta try it for Fruity Plum. I love Fruity Plum. Fruity Plum's the best. It's a good item. It's definitely better than a quality one item. Respectfully. So a classic Wrath fight that looks a lot... Oh, Golden Keys. Excellent timing here. Uh, Wrath is much like Bomber Boy. If you guys ever played that game. I haven't. I just know it exists. I believe it's a retro video game. Wow, lots of bombs. Awesome. Happy to see that. Humbling Bundle really gonna... Really gonna step up our run here. So for those curious, it will give us... 
Now, it used to be just straight up double every consumable drop, so instead of one key, you'd get the pair of keys, and, you know, instead of one coin, you get the, the two stacker. It's now been downgraded to, I think it's like a 50-50 chance whether or not it's doubled, which is still good. It's just, you know, uh, compared to what it used to be, it is not as good, but it is still good. That is that. Let's make that clear. Let's see what the shop has to offer, and uh, luckily not much, so we can try for fruity plum here. Uh, Ventricle razor actually is very interesting. I like ventricle razor. Uh, oh yeah, mom's contact's great. It's a range up as well. Okay, cool. Well, honestly, would have never known. So you gotta be careful here uh, before going into the boss if you want to play your. Blood Bank, mainly because you're going to be trading away Red Hearts most likely in the deal with Devil, so it's like, you know, play it now or when you leave, you're not going to have any Red Hearts to play it with. Move it or lose it. Use it or lose it, I suppose, is probably more appropriate. Loving Lil Brim. He is definitely the star of our show right now. Loving that. One of the better familiars, there's no denying that. I think Succubus is, Succubus and Incubus are also some of the best, I think. I think probably Succubus gets better in the end of the game where you don't really need it to shoot with you anymore. So, by the beginning, Brimstone, little Brimstone is probably one of the best you can get. <laughs> Depending on your run, Incubus can be better. But, just to say, you know, anything other than we have a great starting item like set here, you know, would be... Untrue. I think we've got a great start. I would like to see IV bag. It'd be nice just to be able to, you know, replace our space for item with a much better space for item. Although I understand, you know, some things don't always work out that way. Come on, Fruity Plum. Oh, come on, Fruity Plum, please. Oh, please. Oh, gosh. I'm not giving up on you, Fruity Plum. Don't worry. Uh, we went that way, unfortunately. Okay. I'll blow up this boat. Well, I'll blow up both of them. So what, am I going to play that guy afterwards? No, I'm not going to have any money. Oh, okay. Red hearts are fine. Uh, shoot. Well, I guess you pick it up now and get the half spirit heart while you can. I was thinking, is there any more red hearts on the floor? But I don't believe there was. Blood bag is a great find. Let's just hope. Oh, no. I really want Fruity Plum. I will try anything to get Fruity Plum. Uh, we have not found our secret room. Okay, there we go. There's the angle we were looking for. We got eight bombs. We can find it. Okay, we're, we're smart people. Okay, it's not not there. Make a mental map of the of this floor layout here. So it's not here. We'll try this as well. Oh, shoot. Okay, oh well. Secret room is not there. I can say with certainty. Okay, but it could be over here. It could very well be right here. Okay, let's see what we got. Yes, gotta be, gotta be, gotta be. Not at all. Okay, never mind, never mind, never mind. <laughs> um, so, let's see. This is boom. So, does that have something above it? No. Yeah. Okay, money. That's exactly what we are looking for. We're still a penny shy from our, like, goal. Okay, got it. We got at least two more plays for our friend, Fruity Plum. I'm I'm, di I'm in. Like, I'm in for a penny and for a pound. I, I like Fruity Plum a lot. I think it's worth this money. And um, that's all I got to say about that. Come on, Fruity Plum! Yay! Awesome. I will try once for Tammy's head. It's a better space for item. Didn't get it, and I can live with that. Alright, so we got Fruitster, the fruit man, the plum. Now we're good. Uh, we'd love to see BFF on this run. It makes Brimstone Boy and Fruity Plum very good. And we're using the razor to give ourselves a little... Wow, somehow I snuck around Larry Jr. on that rock. That was actually pretty lucky. The okay, speedball is good. We like the speed. We do. Now, what do we got in the deal with the devil? Ceremonial robes uh, is good enough to take, to be completely honest. I, I'm happy with that. Uh, I actually am pretty happy with that. It doesn't solve our tier problem, but it is damage in the bank, and I'm good with that.
Also, last run we had uh, Chaos. So we went uh, Angel Deals mostly. So, going back to Deals with the Devil, I don't feel too bad about it. Curse the Blind is definitely not ideal. There we go, Fruity Plum. Get in on the action. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, this room shows up a lot. I don't know. I don't like it, to be honest with you. Oh, it's a big battery in there, though, so that's pretty cool. I've already identified a couple places the secret could be. I think it could also be right there. We'll see what this... Oh, yeah, it probably is. Let's, uh, let's do it. Let's see if it is. No, okay. We won't be able to save any keys then. Go into the shop first. Uh, oh, actually just go into the shop because we're not going into the item room. It's Curse the Blind. I don't want a blonde item. I would rather give myself a better planetarium chance. Planetariums usually for me have been wonderful, so... I mean, planetarium items are mostly pretty phenomenal. There's only a couple that are kind of stinkers. It's like, just don't take them then. You know what I mean? Uh, case one. Am I missing anything? Like, really? I'll try to get some more money around on the floor, I suppose. You know, it's... It doesn't hurt to get a couple extra keys or pennies here. You know, I just... Maybe we'll have enough money and we'll buy the blind shop item. I can do that. I, I would risk 15 cents. Because, you know, it's not going to ruin my run to do so. Uh, secret room is here. Okay, more money is exactly what we were talking about. Let's try to get... Even a little more. And I'm using bombs like they're going out of style. I should probably slow my roll. If I see 9 lives here, I'm taking it 100%. I'd actually be really happy with that. Because I don't have too much HP, so it's not like I'm losing much. And it is 9 lives. Yeah, we're happy. I have dead cat. Excellent. We'll even fight in here, just to just to say that we did something. Okay, Soul of Lilith is awesome. I love that card. We're going to get a familiar. Permanently. Logish. He's a good one. Offers slowing. Which is one of the better tier effects you can really ask for, especially from, uh... Are they both the moon? Oh, how about that? Cool. Alright. Hmm. Okay, that's the end of the floor, and we're gonna try a second secret room one time. No. Cool beans. Do you go in here and use a moon card? Sure, why not? Half price curse rooms can be okay. Dice bag. Meh. Oh, wait, I don't have another trinket. I should have just taken it. Oh, well. Oopsie. Made a mistake. Made a mistake. We've got 15 cents, but in the same, like, you know, I'd rather just. I think I want the arcade chance on the next floor because it's caves too, yeah. Just another chance that the IV bag would be great. You know, space bar items are very appealing to me right now. I, I would love to find a way to get a good space bar item. Because I'm not, like, in love with the current one. So, it's a unique situation, you know, where you're not really thinking about... Oh, I need to be... You know, more stats, more stats, more stats. But, okay, sweet, range up. Cool, cool, cool. Uh... We'll, we'll take a chance on it. It's Ghost Baby. I'm good with that. I think that's one more closer conjoined, actually. I believe Brimstone Baby counts as a conjoined familiar. Uh, so we're, we're one away, I believe. Hairpin's a very good trinket. We'll get a full charge on our space bar item when we go into the boss room. That's awesome. If we ever get a, a space item that's like chargeable, that is. So now we're officially out of red hearts. We did hit another low odds deal with the devil, which is all we were doing last round too. So it must be something in the water. Hierophant, happy to have it. Definitely not one to complain about free free real estate here. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna try for the two pennies. Love it. Okay, so we did actually get the arcade and the dice room, which means. I lived my life believing if you got a dice room, that, oh, did not dodge well there. If you got a dice room, you did not get an arcade, but that appears untrue. Um, I don't really want a D4. I feel pretty solid with my run. Okay, so there is a blood bank. 
We'll see if we can't scrounge up some HP here somewhere. Hoping actually the secret room go... Oh, that was a non-friendly poop. It's a good thing we have a lot of HP. I'm not... Again, I'm, I'm not going to be over-analytical of my play because... It's... I don't think it's going to bring me much joy today. I have been... Uh, I've not been playing back-to-back-to-back -to -back -to -back days. It's uh, you know, my first day back, so... I expect mistakes. <laughs> I love our run, though. I really do. I like having all these familiars. So Gish actually does not count as a conjoined. That would be why we don't have conjoined already. For those curious. Okay, it's greed. I suppose that's fine. Um, give me... Is it... Dead? Okay, it's caves, too. I was like, if it's Necropolis 1, we're kind of in not so good a shape. Yeah, Steam sells good. Happy to see it. Item room has little Steven, so there's conjoined. Okay, there you go. We got it. And little Steven's a homing firing guy, so again, another really good familiar. We got we got a lot of them. Hey, and we did get the planetarium. Okay, here we go. What did we get? Uranus. Uh, very, very good. Very, very good. Basically going to make every room uh, beyond cheese at this point at this current point, because we're just going to be able to freeze enemies and be done with the room, like, really early without having to kill them. It's just going to be bosses that are problems. Still. I mean, bosses are still going to be an issue. Yeah, I'm happy to see an Eternal Heart, that's for sure. And I didn't actually find my secret room. And I'll, I'll look a little bit. I can, I can also moon, actually, I'll do that. So, oh. He hit his rock and he got confused. So you can see, I mean, you know, Lil Brem is like a massive damage dealer for us. We love massive damage dealers. Yes, Spar Soap, excellent. We love the tears up. Big tears up, even. Okay, cool, cool, cool. We'll go to the curse room. And then we will moon card. And then I think that'll be... This floor, although I think the secret room is probably right below us, right on that room. It's my guess. What do we got? What do we got? Troll bomb and spiders. And I went through the. I went through the curse room anyway. Okay, cool, cool, cool. I'm a smart gamer. Did I buy the spirit heart from the shop? I don't remember. Was there a spirit heart for sale in the shop? Another good question. Oh. <laughs> my memory seems to be failing me pretty hard right now so we can't actually really do much with our blood bank on this floor it happens you know it's sometimes it's it doesn't it's not the end of the world and now we have a red heart so you know we're still in a great spot love what We've got, though, the piercing with Bram and the, the new newly found Uranus, Uranus, whatever you'd like to say. I feel like I probably shouldn't say Uranus over and over again. I'll just drive myself insane, but... Oh! I always forget these guys are, like, actually very lethal in the creep puddles. Like, a lot of cheap damage. But maybe that's to incentivize, like, movement. Like, hey, you can't be sitting around here all day. Hey, okay, super greed again. I say again because I, I played the run I just played like about an hour ago. I'm just trying to get a couple. Just because it's, it's hard to get ice again every day. So like when I have time, I try to give myself, you know, a couple runs because I, I miss some days. And okay, D6 this time. But I like Conjoined and I like Uranus. Like I don't want to reroll into something bad. I'm fine with enough. I'm fine enough with what I've got at the current moment to be good. Like sitting with it for now. Okay, what do we got in this room? Nothing, right? No, it's no, no tinted rock. Okay, I do want those keys though. And I, I also kind of do want to fight the challenge room for the two red chests. It's just guppies on the radar, right? We got nine lives for, for without really having to do anything. So I'm like, it's on the radar to try and get more guppy items and potentially become 
the Gubster. Like, that would be great for us, you know, especially with the conjoined uh, already kind of popped off for us. We're not really aiming for too much more. Oh, yeah, Lost Contact's great. Oh, Curse of Lost we have on this floor. I must have forgotten. Or I don't know if I ever knew that. Let's just put it that way. Fifty-six cents. I don't know where all that money came from, but we've got it. Honestly, I feel like we've just been playing, and maybe we just got a lot of money. That's humbling bundle probably for you. Is the the truth? And all there is in there is a pill baggy and a, a spirit heart. But I'm happy for the spirit heart, so can't really complain. Small rock, we'll take. We've got good speed. I'm fine sloughing a bit off for good tears. Good tears and good damage. Actually, that was a big damage up. Conceivably now, with our current build, we should not be really getting overwhelmed by projectiles. Oh, sweet. These rooms switch places. I like. I think that part about Curse of the Maze is cool. Is like rooms will switch. So there you go. You see what we're doing? We're just... Oh, okay, yeah, Mom's... Con we have so many good, like, tier effects and items on this run. Like, Freezing is a great tier effect, and then also Petrify is a really good tier effect. It gets better on bosses, because they actually get affected by it. And a speed up, again. Okay, we got our speed back. Very nice. Ooh. Yeah, you want Bloody Lust, I'm sure of that. Bloody Lust and Abaddon, so cool beans. Um... Let's go. Ah, oh, why didn't I do the, the the challenge room? I just talked about it. So this floor, I'm going to try to be very careful with uh, how much HP I just kind of give away. Uh, oh, we are really fast. i got to get used to that here. But at least on that floor, we got a good amount of damage up. Bloody Lust is phenomenal. It does work with the Razor if we have Red Hearts that I'm willing to donate to the cause, that is. So we need HP. We want HP. Although we're kind of past the point in the run where you're going to find a lot of HP ups, unfortunately. We just need to hope that there's uh, bums, like beggars, that we can play. Because they, they drop HP pretty regularly. Do we have any evil ups? We do. So it's already more valuable to me than my current setup with Hairpin. Because we don't have a space frame still. I mean, I don't have enough of a... Yeah, I was thinking, of like, maybe we get a library, but, like, we haven't even picked up a book yet, so I don't know if we're really going to get a library on this run. Is this steps two? Shoot, it is. Okay. I don't like having the... I'm just ner... Wow. Sausage. Okay. Yeah. Wow, that's huge. That's actually awesome. That's beyond huge. That's that's wonderful. It's an all stats up in every sense of the word. Cool. <laughs> that's actually that's awesome. So I was I was just about to say I don't like my chances going into the womb right now, but after that all stats up. Ooh, tractor beam conjoined is very strong. It does hurt our like you know, our our fire hose aesthetic, like we were just, or it wasn't a fire hose, now it's a fire hose. We, we were kind of like using the sprinkle setting on the, mystery gift, sprinkle setting on the, <laughs> what am I trying to say? The sprinkler setting on like the hose, on like a hose, you know, where it's just kind of like flying out, boom. Okay, we got euthanasia. That's a really good one as well. We'll buy the card and stars. So cool. We got to teleport out. Oh, it doesn't matter. We, we actually did make great time on the back half of this run. And I can't really complain. Okay. Hopefully we don't take damage on mom. But we're going to start doing some big damage. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's basically like a triple shot that doesn't affect our rate of fire anymore. The spirit heart there was a massive pickup for my confidence. So my confidence now, after that floor of gaining two, we got a red heart and a spirit heart. My confidence is going up big time.
Wow, I love that. So Uranus, again, you know, I'm showing you guys exactly what I was saying is no lie. Uranus, very good. Uh, I would love... To, oh, there's a Tinted Rock right there. I was about to say, I'd love to find a Tinted Rock here. Ah, uh, oh, okay, what do we got? It was a Tears Up from Constellation Prize. Okay, t our Tears being at four was our lowest stat, so... Kind of cool. I like that. The, the freeze on these guys is phenomenally good. So here's where you start going crazy, right? You go boom to get the permanent damage. And then pick up a red heart. And then you know, do it again just to maintain polar invincibility. We're using Razor to our best ability. You know, we also have Bloody Lust. So these hits we're taking are, are going to matter, probably. Like they're going to give us a little bit of damage. I am upset. Got a lot of great tier effects. So euthanasia adds very much to our lethality. It's you to our one, so I just say let's go. I'm just worried. We got low HP. Like we really do have low HP. I'm not confident right now. I had confidence going into this floor. And I lost it again. It was gone very quickly. Uh, there's spun. That's awesome. Spirit of the night and book of the dead. I am. Well, I have nine lives. I have nine lives. So let's think about this then. Let's do it. Let's do it. We got nine lives. So let's play the game like we've got nine lives. Let's do it. I'm happy. I'm good with Book of the Dead. Spear of the Night's awesome. Flight and Spectral, you can't say enough good things about. And, I mean, I, I don't need that, unfortunately. I don't need the wind spoon. So now we are flying by the seat of our pants. We've got no prospects, basically. HP wise, let me say that. I should be using Book of the Dead. Why the heck am I not? Oh, that guy actually isn't technically dead until I break him. Okay, we learning lessons along the way. Look at this. I just like froze them all in the line. That's pretty cool. Uh, we'll go in. And we'll star scars out. Stars cars. <laughs> stars card out. Looking to get enough of a charge on Book of the Dead to matter. Because Book of the Dead can be pretty big here. I mean, it seems late in the game for something like that, but it's totally true. I mean, we get a little skeleton army going, and all of a sudden we're in a really good spot. Okay, I'm fine with a 5 here. I will re-roll the floor. Okay, so kill these guys, and then use Book of the Dead for it. So there we go, we got a bony brother. Boneman. Yeah, I just killed him because I'm the smartest player on planet Earth, apparently. Okay, there's a vault and an ar and a what am I thinking of? A dice room on this floor. That's interesting. I feel like I'm learning a lot about map generation. I was under the impression you can only get like one of these on a floor. But that's obviously not the case. So, interesting to learn. I love that there's just a key beggar in the vault. I love that. In my completely unbiased opinion, they need to make that room better. The vault room. There needs to be, like, actually a reason to want to go in there. Other than just, like, sometimes you get some money. Yeah, there's that one time you get, like, 15 cents in there. And then the rest is like, oh, yeah, there's, there's just, like, a pile of poop on the floor. On some of these. It's really, you know. It's anybody's guess. Oh, hush, huh? Oh, I don't know if that's what I want. <laughs> I don't know if that's what I want. It's a good place to become stronger, but we don't have a whole lot of leeway. Like, if we get hit, then we're just constantly stuck in a, a getting hit and dying cycle. You only get hit once and it's game over. That being said, if we make it to Hush, this time I'll think about it. Because Hush, is a, it, it, it honestly is a really good place to get stronger. Like, I, I truly do believe that. It's not as much of a risk as it might seem. Especially since we've got so many good, you know, like we can petrify Hush, you know, we can we can slow him. 
We can freeze his teammates. Give me the HP upgrade and I'll do it. Okay. That's that's confidence enhanced right there. I know I keep for some reason I keep harping on confidence this run. I don't know. Maybe that's just what's on my mind. Loving it. Okay. Chaos card is undeniably the most valuable thing we could have found there. It's an insta-kill on Hush, I believe. It used to be. Okay, we're gonna... Huh? Book of the Dead? We need to find our boss. Sorry, don't have time for you. Don't have time for you guys either. Oh, no, 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 no. Hush is free, guys. We gotta go, we gotta go. I, I'm sure I'll have enough time. I just need to go the right way. Hopefully that's what I'm doing right now. Pills, I'm okay. This one's good. It'll give us a spirit heart. Thank you, Gary Jr. That's good. We've got to be going the right way, I think, at this point. Okay. Get the key. Get the money. Get the heck out of Dodge. I'm nervous. No, I'm no longer nervous. We found our boss. We're good. We do great damage, though. My goodness. Okay, there we go. There's Delirium and Hush, but we don't want to do Delirium. <laughs> I'll do Hush. We got the Chaos card. Let's go to the shop first. Sackhead. It's good. Lodestone's great. I had to think about that for a second. And Sissy Long Legs is better because I already have a space where I'm pretty happy with. Hey, a Spirit Heart. Two Spirit Hearts, actually. And we became Mom. Oh my goodness, and Mr. Dolly. See, this is what I'm saying. Like, coming to Hush, we became a million times stronger. Not a million, but we, we, we gained a lot. From coming here. <clears throat> we got Lodestone. It's just another top top 10 item as far as tier effect granting items go. It's very strong, especially against Hush, you know, because it pulled he he's one of those bullet just makers. Like he just has a ton of bullet spawning. Okay, so now we go this, we go, huh? Okay, game over. Perfection, I can't imagine actually does too much for us anymore. Okay. Cathedral. We're almost there. I think secret room's below this room. We're gonna take a chance. Ooh. I have greed. Okay. We got enough money. It's a it honestly, I have greed is a great example of like a double edged sword. Like for the most part, if you hit that coin, it's it's good. Otherwise, you miss your coin and you pay the coin just to shoot something. It's not so good. I'd say by and large, though, I have greed's great. And we have so much money at this point that's like, you know. It is something you do need to think about pretty seriously. If you're a serious thinker. Like, if you're on Basement 2 or something. And you need money. I don't know if I have greed is for you. It's definitely not a guaranteed pickup. And our range is 22. So it went from really low to now we shoot really high. Cool. Uh, so we actually didn't get to use Bloody Lust on this floor to the degree I would have liked. But we did get Redemption. Which, now that I'm looking at it, is actually going to do nothing for us. That's unfortunate. Dang, we went the wrong way. Which way is the right way? Probably... Probably looking at it, I'm betting top... T let's just go up. Let's see, what, what's this, uh, let's see what's up here. What's up, Doc? Hey, baby plum. Pretty plum, that's your... estranged cousin. Baby Plum is like my worst enemy, and Fruity Plum is like my greatest ally, so it's really kind of poetic. 
I hate baby plum. But I love fruity plum. Okay, greed was hanging around somewhere there. Uh, Locust of death or black feather. I think I'm good with what I got, to be honest with you. I feel good about it. Now, Lodestone here would actually be better without Tractor Beam, but I think this run is much better with Tractor Beam as a whole. I say Lodestone's better without Tractor Beam because it adds a homing effect to your tiers on, like, marked enemies. And when you have Conjoin, you know, to start filing in all those, all that stuff, which can be really good. The counterpoint is Tractor Beam is pretty much a guaranteed all three hit if you're aiming at the enemy anyway. And that's like, okay, yeah, good point. I don't know, what do you even call this run? It's just it's just kind of a myriad of good tier effects. You know what I mean? I'll give it to Uranus though. I think yeah, I don't know, I'm looking at these items. Sausage was a great pickup. I love seeing sausage. I love all stats ups in general, I think most people do. Okay, join me little haunt. Join me lucky foot and flatstone also acceptable. Only thing we can't really take with us is the Minecrafter. Hey, oh, I don't know why I'm getting that excited. We don't have a... Uh... For some reason, I thought that might have been Guppy. Uh, but it's not. It's not Guppy. It's close. Close Middle Scar. So, Luckfoot means take pills. The world's great. Uh, the Bean. Wow, okay. Betrayal. I like Betrayal. The infighting is actually really nice. Where enemies can now hit each other just by shooting. Like sometimes their shots are just... Wow, I love that. That must be... That's euthanasia lodestone. Wow. I think tractor beam is what allows me to break the tier cap here. Glowing hourglass is obviously a very good item. I'm sorry, why am I going the wrong way if I know the right way? You guys are asking some good questions today. I like that, keeping me honest. This is a phenomenal run. Maybe I'll give this one to Tractor Beam. I don't know. I need something for the title just because it's... I can't just write, it was a good run. I mean, it was, but like, there's got to be some... Some more... Oh, 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 baby plum, huh? Hello. Hello. This is a run that is honestly, weirdly enough, probably strong enough to fight delirium. Like, anytime you have lost contact, you're definitely in the mix for something like that. Like, it was so easy. You know what I mean? Like, that was just so easy. Okay. Uh, there's a seed. Maybe I forgot to show you. Maybe I didn't. I don't know. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you all for win 27, because I'm manifesting now. We're winning them all.